That's right. This incredible potion will take multiple years right off you. And for a ridiculous price of $5. More useless trash. Those feather heads aren't going to help us with an escape plan. Mr. Peabody? <laughs> Miss Betty, perhaps? Might as well. You never know. Yeah. Oh. <gasps> oh. Oh. Wow, this is so oh. cool! Oh. <laughs> yeah, what is this stuff here? <laughs> oh. But what's making me jump around like this? Yeah, I get it. I've been changed into a flea. Joe, the penitentiary can't keep teenagers inside. Only adults can be kept in prison. Uh -huh. <laughs> Drink up, boys! Ah! Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, check him out! No more mustache! <laughs> <laughs> hey, team! Now that me and my brothers are teenagers, we don't belong here in a grown-up prison. That's the law. See ya! What? The law? <laughs> Go get the rule books now! Hey, guys, can I come with you? I want to ditch these old guys. Of course. It'll be cool having a girl in our gang. Girl! <laughs> <laughs> hey, you! Oh. Do it however you can, but get them back to the real ages. Uh, it's just that I don't remember the magic formula. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, you're good. Sheesh. You're Adios ready? to this you're retirement home. Oh. Open the doors. <laughs> Mr. Peabody! <laughs> Indeed, according to law, adolescents cannot be held in a penitentiary unless... A social worker is employed by the director to work with them. Eight, nine. Hey, guys, I got nine hairs on my chest. <laughs> Daughters, let me introduce Eric, your social worker. Hi, kids. I'm here to help you. Being a teenager is tough. Your body changes. Acne bursts out all everywhere like on a battlefield. Hair starts growing all over, your voice deepens, <laughs> and most of all, you've got no idea of what you're doing uh, later in life. I do too! Me and my brothers know exactly what we're going to do! Hold up banks! <laughs> I want to hold up banks too! And give poor people the money from those nasty rich people! A typical girly idea! Oh. <laughs> but Robin Banks ain't a real job. A plumber! Now that is an excellent job. And you know, people always need plumbers. I don't get it. Usually fleas don't three hundred times higher than the actual size. <laughs> hey, where are your kids going? Come back! Huh? Archaeologist, now that's a fabulous profession. And this time, don't try and escape. I still trust mm -hmm. you. <laughs> Follow me. Garbage collection, there's a useful job. And no escape attempts. I'm trusting you. We're free! <laughs> <laughs> Dog groomer, trapper, ballet dancer. <sighs> 53 professions, 53 <sighs> escape attempts. I don't know what to suggest to you guys. How about a social worker like you? Is that complicated? Are you crazy? Social worker, that's a stupid job. I never wanted to do this as a job. I had a dream. I wanted to... I wanted to raise badgers. I know it's silly. But no, it isn't silly. And it's never too late. You're the one who said... So. Yeah, that's true. Huh? You're absolutely right. I quit. Oh, Just wait. wait. I'm on if my you way. leave, I'll have to let them go. That's right. See you around, old folks. <laughs> <laughs> I'm warning you. It's the Wild West out there, and it's full of dangerism. Come on, Grandpa. Stop whining and open the doors. Grandpa? Okay, you asked for it. <laughs> 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 huh? All 
right. Hands up, mustachios. <laughs> Hands up. Hey, who are these little kids in pajamas? Ain't it time for your snack with your mama? <laughs> no squeaks. Okay, let's start over. What have I done? The Daltons are out there. This is a catastrophism. The formula. Good grief. Remember it. <laughs> I have been changed into a miserable flea. <laughs> but what if I'm not a flea, but a louse? And less love here, like yours. And <laughs> uh, uh, oh. I remember the formula. But now what difference does it make? <laughs> well then, Daltons, felt like coming back home again. Fabulous Falcon, if you don't mind. Ustra Fabula! Delighted to find you at a more reasonable age, my dear Betty. I say, I have no idea you had that streak of rebellionism. Me? Oh, not at all, sir. I was a model child. As for you, Daltons, your youthful impulses seem to prevent you from remembering that you can't fool an old <laughs> hand like me. That's funny, cause Joe loved fooling around. Shut up, Admiral! Shut, Shut up! up. <laughs> <laughs> How stretchy this new fabric is! He drives me crazy! Acting like this is home! We need an escape plan! Well, I have a great one! We dress up as socks! Socks are allowed outside, right? <laughs> Got any other stupid plans? And what makes my plan any dumber than yours? Because I'm short and smart and you're big and stupid! <laughs> <laughs> that was the worst of an unintelligible whisper. Yes, I have a product that tricks everything. Trees, boats, horses, dishes. An adult? Ah, uh, yes, but there could be side effects. No. <laughs> William, there's two of you. No, it's Averill. <laughs> yeah, I decided to shrink myself to be short and smart like you. <laughs> I did it! I bet Fabulous Falcon gave you a potion. Got some for us? Nope, it's all gone. Well, with two Joes, we should be able to cook up a really smart plan. First one of us with a plan wins. That's funny! When you're smarter, everything looks bigger! I have a plan! Gee, I feel a bit peculiar. Oh, what's wrong with that poor dog? Uh, <laughs> nothing at all. <laughs> Something here's a bit off, but what? Yes, it being St. Melvin's Day and all, I reckon that. <laughs> well, there you go. Hmm? A Dalton doll, it's very lifelike. What's inside? Is it marshmallow? Hey, hands off, that's fragile. And it goes right here. <laughs> here we go. Avril gets the prison key and it's goodbye. Let's wait here. No. So ugly. Oh. Joe! Joe! <laughs> ah, what's taking him so long? <gasps> ah! We just need to shrink the legs a wee bit. Oh. Maybe now he'll understand what we say. Hmm?
He's more and more agitated. But where did he go? Look, there's chewing gum under Rin Tin Dum's paw. It's Avril. Where's the key? What are you saying? Gods! Someone stole the key to the prison! <laughs> this has to be the Daltons! Mm? Where's Avril? Are you gonna talk? <laughs> Watch out, a bee! Unbelievable. Avril escaped all by himself. Emmett, Pete, go after him. Oh. Avril escaped all by himself. He's a genius. Whoa, I'm the one with the key. Still no sign of him. Where can he be? You see him? Yes! Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> huh? There he is! <laughs> Look, he's teeny tiny! No, no, dummy, it's because he's far away. After him! <laughs> We get out of here without them seeing us. It's easy. Take off a sock. You really want to do that? Well, well yeah. yeah. Avril's a, a genius. genius. And now let's go. Huh? Wild socks, really? Oh, they look like caterpillars to me. Can't you see they're the Daltons? Go get them! <laughs> The caterpillar is turning into Daltons. <laughs> <laughs> Next time you think of a plan, stuff a sock in it, genius. Great! Start by finding the magic bean, and then we'll see. And he's off. I don't believe A it. A magic bean, please! The kind that reaches the sky! For every bean you buy, Fabulous Falcon gives you another one free. Don't bother wrapping them. We're on our way right now! Mm -hmm. You're beginning to really annoy me with your fairy tale nonsense! Uh -huh. Time. I've been in this land post for so long. Huh? Avril, you're a genius. There aren't any dragons here, right? Of course not. Not in Jack and the Beanstalk. But there's a hand that lays golden eggs and... Gold eggs? Well, yeah, and Little Jack stole it and took it home to his mama who was poor. I'd say we're headed for a jackpot and that life is a true fairy tale. But we have to watch out for the hen's owner. You see, he's a real... Jump in the pond! The mud will cover our scent!
Follow him. Volunteers to retrieve the Daltons, one step forward. Show some bravery, boys. Brinton Dunn will be there with you. Uh, I hear there's an ogre up there. Mm -hmm. What nonsense! You believe in that silliness at your age? Well then, let chance choose you. Eeny, meeny, miny, moe. Catch a guardian by his toe. <laughs> <laughs> I just love fun fairs. Yeah, this big wheel is awfully high up. Yeah, <laughs> while the big guy snoozes, we grab the bean, easy as pie. Quiet, you ninny. Are you trying to wake up the ogre? Relax, Joe. Fairy tales always have happy endings for the good guys. Birdie! We are not good guys, you big ninny. <laughs> See, I knew there was an ogre. I'm so hungry I could eat a wolf. How do we recognize the hen? Easy! Whenever you say lay, she lays a solid gold egg. No. The hen! I found the hen! Lay, lay, lay! No. 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 Ooh, yay! A rubber duck game! I love this! Nintendo! You're going to wake up the... Ogre? <laughs> ah! But I'm telling you, there's a happy ending. Well, now that lays the cake. <laughs> if we're not the good guys, you think we'll get eaten, Joe? Huh? Let me handle this. We are the bad guys. They are. Huh? Jack came with his brother to steal your hen. But, but we're not stealing his bird. Ah! <laughs> oh. Come on, let's get out of here. Well, enjoy your meal. Let's go. But wait, eating people is even worse. Isn't that so, Jack? Uh, fuck! Did I hear Jack? Fairy tales, but let's be on the safe side. We didn't even bring back one egg. Don't worry, Joe. We're going back. No, not it. 